Contact the field teams for a progress report. Yes, sir. I'm Commander Shepard. We've been expecting you. Just a moment. And Hadley, could you gather the Leviathan data for us? Apologies, Commander. The rest of my team is out investigating leads right now. I'm Dr. Garrett Bryson, and this is Task Force Aurora. What's your assignment? Our mandate is to investigate legends, rumors, old stories about the Reapers before anyone knew they existed. That's an interesting goal, but is anyone doubting the Reapers exist these days? The Alliance is still desperate for intelligence. Reaper motives, their operational tactics. Anything that can give us an edge. Then how did you wind up in charge? When the rest of the galaxy says something doesn't exist, I take that as a chance to prove that it does. So you're in it for the challenge? For the truth. Even as late as 2148, humanity still thought aliens were a myth. That was within my lifetime. Once that myth was proven to be reality, our entire history changed. Reapers were part of that reality, too. But even they have a history, Commander. If we can just uncover it, there may be a weakness we can exploit. Alliance resources are stretched pretty thin. Is this really worth the time? Just imagine if this task force had existed three years ago when you discovered the Prothean Beacon. This whole war might not have happened. But now with new information we've uncovered, a breakthrough's near. Hadley, do you have the data? No! This is Commander Shepard. I need C-Sec at my location, now! You shouldn't be here. The darkness can't be breached. Transit records show his name is Derek Hadley. He's worked here for a couple months. Shepard, I monitored a CSEC alert from this location. Were you harmed? I'm fine, but I could use your help sorting this out, Edie. Take a look through their files. I need to know what this task force was up to. At once. What? I... What's happening? You just shot your boss. He's dead. Why? After you arrived, it was dark, cold, like I was somewhere else. That wasn't... Take a good look. You did that. You pulled the trigger and killed him. No. No! I couldn't have. No! I'm not a murderer! I saw you pull the trigger. Then you tried to kill me. I swear, I didn't! Commander, this does resemble reports of indoctrination. Indoctrination? Me? What about that Leviathan Bryson mentioned? How does that tie in? It's some kind of creature. Our field teams have been tracking it. That artifact came in from our researcher, Garneau. He sent an audio log if you wanna... What's wrong? Turn back. What are you talking about? The darkness cannot be breached. Get him over to the clinic. See if they can tell us what's wrong with him. Yes, ma'am. Commander, you'll want to see this. It's an outgoing message from Dr. Bryson to Admiral Hackett. Dr. Bryson, you have an update? Admiral, the Leviathan of Dis that we've been investigating, I think we're really onto something. Give me the brief. About 20 years ago, the Batarians discovered a Reaper corpse that had died in battle. They covered it up and denied it ever existed. But I'm intrigued by the larger implication. What could have killed the Reaper in the first place? Exactly. That's the real Leviathan. It's worth pursuing. Continue your investigation and update me on the progress. There is also a follow-up message from a few weeks later 
Admiral, the Reapers are shadowing my field teams as if they're hunting Leviathan themselves. Whatever it is, I believe Leviathan is nothing less than a Reaper killer. Almost an apex predator, and it has them nervous. If we could just find it, imagine the impact on the war. I'm formally requesting assistance in tracking it down. You'll have it. This is now your top priority, Doctor. Find that thing. It appears we were meant to be that assistance. I see Bryson's point. Anything capable of bringing a Reaper down is worth finding. Despite the potential dangers it could pose, I would agree. But we won't know unless we can find it. Bryson's assistant did say they recently received a log from their field researcher. It may yield more information. This must be the artifact the assistant mentioned. And here's the log. Dr. Bryson, it's Garneau. I'm sending you an artifact I found. About the only thing I found there, in fact. Maybe it's nothing, but... I'd swear Leviathan came through here. I'm gonna crunch some numbers. Burn up the rest of this project travel allowance. Maybe I can project our Reaper Killer's movements. I'll check in when I get to the next site. Garno appears to be our best lead to track Leviathan, but he does not stay to destination. He's out there somewhere. We need him. I'll do what I can. Bryson and his colleagues evidently used a galaxy map search program in their hunt for Leviathan. It may help us locate Garno. Does this tell us where Garno went? No. But we may be able to narrow down his location if we find clues he was using in his search for Leviathan. These are all murders in which the accused lacked a known motive and claimed memory loss. Just like Bryson's assistant. You think Garneau was following a trail of blackout crimes? It is possible. We need to find data matching dates and locations for crimes of this nature. Here's the time and date chart for the crimes. Can you filter for murders where the killer claimed memory loss? Adding the search filter, you may examine the results on the Galaxy Map program. Bryson was tracking unexplained creature sightings. Bryson was not merely tracking sightings. He was attempting to extrapolate a course. And Garneau could have been following that course. Edie, can you add a search filter for systems along that projected path? Adding this search filter to the galaxy map. Meteorite fragment, maybe? He was studying it. Meteorite sample. With traces of element zero. Would Leviathan need Ezo? While it is not consumed as fuel during FTL travel, element zero will decay after several centuries of active use. If Leviathan is old enough, it would need to replenish its supplies. Okay. Can you give me a search filter for locations with element zero? Adding the search filter now. March 7th, 2186. I'm looking at the Rakdai. Their movements during the Rakdai Wars suggest alien influence. But the timing is wrong, and Rakdai weren't implanted with Reaper tech. What if Leviathan was preparing the Rachni to fight the Reapers? What do you think, Edie? It is possible that Bryson's team is using ancient Rachni fleet activity to find Leviathan. If we can find data on the movement of ancient Rachni ships, it may help us narrow our search. Those appear to be sightings of ships that match Rachni signatures. Can you add a cross-reference for locations of sightings? Adding it now. Sovereign. Vanguard of our destruction. How's that working out for you, big guy? Sir, this is Bryson. We know the Reapers are after Leviathan. Studying Reaper hunting patterns could be vital to finding it. That data is classified top secret, Dr. Bryson. If it falls into the wrong hands, it 
won't. The data's encrypted. I'll keep the decryption key safe. Close to my heart. Close to his heart? Hell does that mean? The Reaper fleet activity is encrypted, per Bryson's statement in the log. He said he was keeping the decryption key close to his heart. She works for the Alliance. Bryson was keeping the encryption key close to his heart. What's closer than family? Well, take a look at that. I can use these numbers to construct a decryption key. Alright, let's get back to the data pad we found earlier. Decryption complete. Analyzing data. These movements do not match the standard invasion pattern. The Reapers are searching for something. And I'll bet Garno used this intel. Can you make a search filter for it? Doing so now. Reaper activity. Based on the search results, Garno is in one of these five systems. I have marked the Normandy map with possible locations. We can leave now, unless you wish to further narrow the search. Element zero deposits. Three possibilities. Alien sightings. We have a match. Marking the galaxy map. Good. Let's go find Garno.
We're about five minutes out, Commander. What exactly is on this asteroid? Mining facility. TGS Mineral Works. Small operation. Could be a good place for Leviathan to hide. Powerful enough to take down a Reaper, but hiding from the war. There's more to this. I just hope Garneau has the answers we need. I'm reading Reaper enemy signatures in the asteroid field. Bryson said they were shadowing his field teams. If they're after Leviathan 2, Reapers are a good sign. That's not something you hear every day. Take us in. Cortez, we'll grab this guy and be right out. Keep me updated on the Reaper situation. Yes, Commander. Scouting party. All worse by the sound. Likely the civilians will be frightened. They still there? I've taken care of them for now. I see. That will be all. That will be. Hello? Yes. Welcome to TGS Mineral Works. How can we help you? Yes. For the tour. Please sign in. Look, we don't have time to waste. I'm looking for a researcher, Dr. Garneau. It would have arrived within the last couple weeks. If he's still here, I need to speak to him. We have no Dr. Garneau. Do you need to see a doctor? How about I just go in and look around? No. The excess elevator is broken. And now... We're done. Step away. Step away. You don't belong here. Commander, something is wrong here. Let's look around. Carefully. seem fearful. It is difficult to determine why. I should repair the elevator. 
I'll set the drone to repair the elevator, but we have to stay with it. Access at one point before going into hiding. <sighs> Unknown male was involved in an altercation in the mines. This guy, no human, was headed to the mines. <clears throat> Looks like he was taken to the med bay. You're in the mineral lab, a low security, all access area. The med bay is restricted to authorized personnel with active patient file numbers. I have the file number. Let's go get Garnell. This is a restricted area. Personnel ID number is required. I don't have that. Access denied. Area. An active patient file number is required. 
file 7364. Access granted. Is that Garneau? It is difficult to tell. Dead humans all look alike. <sighs> if you are looking for Garneau, you have found him. I am Dr. Garneau. I'm Commander Shepard of the Alliance. Are you all right? Yes. Only I'm trapped in here. What's been going on in this place? I was doing my research. Until the incident. They attacked you. It's true. But aside from my confinement, I'm fine. Whatever's going on here, I need you to focus. Of course, Commander. I need you to tell me everything you found on the Leviathan. Bryson seemed to think it killed a Reaper. It's a myth. A dead end. What of the artifact you spoke of in your message? I did? No. Yes, Doctor, you did. But now we've got Reaper forces attacking, so I need to break you out. We'll grab the artifact and go. Reapers. The darkness must not be breached. The darkness? Why do you pursue me? Doctor?
There's the door. Okay, let's find that artifact. What was that? Looks like the door's power supplies went cut. The trouble spots are out there. This drone can repair it. We'll need to escort it. Unfortunately, the drone is damaged and is on reserve power. Let's make it quick then. Stay close to the drone. Got it. Shepard, over here. What have you got? That was not Garneau. This is. It appears he's been dead for a while. So Leviathan can have Bryson killed, can take over this colony, and he can use them as puppets. Huh. Anything else useful? Encrypted data, and a personal log with eight missed calls from a 
Dr. Anne Bryson. Anne Bryson? Who... Who are you? What are you doing here? I'm Commander Shepard. Are you all right? I think so. I feel like... I feel strange, but... All right. That artifact, do you know where it came from? Came out of the mine. Right. Head office was supposed to send someone. That's about all I can... Do you recognize this man? I've never seen him before in my life. Someone here killed him. Someone here? How is that possible? I'm so sorry. Can you tell me anything about what happened to you? Not really. I, uh, remember... It just seemed cold. I remember a, a feeling... Cold and dark. If dark was a feeling, that's exactly what I felt. Cortez, what's your situation? Can you bring the shuttle? Affirmative. Strangest thing. A couple of minutes ago, the Reaper forces broke off and left. Reaper? What's a Reaper? What year do you think this is? 2176. 2176 was 10 years ago. What? Let's arrange for these people to be evacuated into temporary quarantine. These people are unaware of the past 10 years. Many things will shock them. Leviathan not only has the power to destroy a Reaper, but possesses an indoctrination ability. What if it is a Reaper? If it's a Reaper, we need to know its motivations. How long has it been out here, and more importantly, why? Edie, did we get anything from Garno's notes? Yes. They suggest that Garno created a way to block the artifact's mind-affecting properties. The artifact seems to be the key. Agreed. When I head back to Bryson's office, I want you there. Yes, Commander. I want to know just what the hell these artifacts really are and what they can do. Whatever they are, their power and danger are clear. And we've got one sitting right in the middle of the Citadel.
need to shield the artifact they've got here right away. Using Garno's data, I should be able to accomplish this without difficulty. Damn thing's been here the whole time. Why weren't we affected? Perhaps the amount of time spent near the artifact is key. After a certain duration, it affords Leviathan an impressive mind control capability. If the Reapers are worried about it, then Leviathan has my attention. We could use that kind of edge. Nevertheless, we should remain cautious. It's likely that Leviathan compelled Bryson's assistant to murder him. Point taken. Just shows we don't know what we're dealing with. Despite the risk, this artifact remains our only link to finding Leviathan. Perhaps we could find more information about it here in the lab. Agreed. Bryson's team might have turned up something we missed. I'll look around. They were testing the artifact for energy emissions. And found anything interesting about the artifact's structure? It is not constructed of the same compounds used in standard Reaper technology. Beyond that, nothing of relevance. Edie, what project was Garneau working on when he found the artifact? Basilisk. Got anything on Basilisk? Several ships, a mythical creature, and a rare mid-tier enemy type in the Galaxy of Fantasy video game. It possesses a gaze attack capable of triggering synced animation kills. Player forms describe it as overpowered. I meant the project, Edie. Oh. Then... no. There's got to be something here on this artifact. What about the server? Bryson's assistant wiped the office server and destroyed all backups, likely before killing Bryson. However, records show new messages on Bryson's personal comm terminal upstairs. Could be worth a look. A message from Dr. Bryson's daughter, Anne. According to my records, she worked with her father. something about the artifact. She's the only one who does. Wherever she is, we have to find her. She sounded concerned for her safety. If Reaper forces are closing on her position... Then we find her first. She said she was in the Pylos Nebula, working for Project Scarab. That cluster contains several systems. I'll call up the Nebula on the galaxy map. We may also search the lab for clues to narrow down her location. Anything in Anne Bryson's work history suggest where she might be? Nothing relevant. Any idea if Project Scarab involved Element Zero? Unlikely. We may learn more from the Project Requisitions Locker. Any correlation between Project Scarab and these unexplained creature sightings? Not beyond Leviathan itself. The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to open it. The locker is secure. We must locate an access card to What about criminal activity in the Pylos Nebula? Because the area is part of the Attica Traverse, criminal reports are unreliable at best. Access card for the requisitions locker? Yes. According to records, it was- Let's see what Anne Bryson requisitioned for Project Scarab. Didn't need an environmental suit. Wind protection gear. Based on what Anne Bryson did or did not requisition, the dig site was arid but habitable. 
Get me a filter for systems with compatible planets. Based on the search data, it is one of these two systems. Bryson's assistant Hadley. Do we have an update on his status? He is in a vegetative state. The doctors believe it is permanent. But the miners recovered when the artifact was destroyed. Hadley lost consciousness when he attempted to answer our questions about Leviathan. It may have been a deliberate attempt to silence him permanently. Anne Bryson flew out on a ship called the Icarus. Can you track its movements? No. The Reapers have disrupted civilian comm buoys. But we might learn more if we find the ship's specifications. There are specifications for several ships here. We need to find the Icarus. The Icarus. Here we go. The ship has enhanced electrostatic discharge cells. They facilitate long-range FTL travel. So they jumped to the Pylos Nebula by mass relay, then flew to another system? Yes. Otherwise, they would have chartered a less expensive ship. Okay, we can rule out the relay system. Based on the data, only one system remains a viable possibility. Good. Let's go get Anne Bryson. located Anne Bryson's dig site. Reports of an attack at this excavation site? Right. Edie, can you tell us anything else? This is the main site of a series of excavations established under Dr. Garrett Bryson. Staff records confirm the project lead is his daughter, Anne. She has recently uncovered another artifact possibly linked to Leviathan. That discovery must have made this dig site a target. Attack means we're on the right trail. And since Bryson's daughter is our only lead, our objective is clear. 
Cortez? Nothing so far, Commander. If she's down there, she hasn't responded to our hails. Getting some strange signals, though. Give me a minute. The artifact she uncovered may have caused additional complications. Agreed. Take us in closer. Copy that. We have hostiles! Take us in. Commander, on the landing platform! That's her! Copy that! 
there! Commander, they attacked my assistant Hopkins. We're being cornered. Stay hidden, Doctor. We're trying, but there's too many of them. Hurry! Tried to run. I told him not to, but he wanted to help the others. Where did everyone go? They're not coming. We have to keep moving. Yes, of course. I uh, was at another dig site when they attacked. I got back as quick as I could, but what's happening? Shepard, look. I'm not sure, but it might have something to do with these paintings. Is that Leviathan? Y yes Yes, we think so. It's, it's old, much older than my father thought. And there, as if the natives were under its power. Clearly a reaper, but acting alone. Not like any reaper we've seen before. Doctor, I understand you found something recently. The artifact? Yes, of course. Incredible. It's just ahead. It may sound strange, but I'm certain it affects people. Their behavior. I've only had a short time to study it. Not strange at all. Did you find anything? Not much, but I did learn something about the energy it generates. Get down! Cortez, 
We have Ann Bryson. Need a pickup. On my way, Commander. Copy that. You see the shuttle, you run. Don't look back. Okay. Yes. Itself? That's incredible. The Reaper seem as interested in it as we are. Yeah, it certainly seems that way. We were hoping you could help us figure out why. But first, Doctor, I have some bad news. And please. Suppose Leviathan's broken away from the other Reapers, never went back to dark space, like a rogue or even a defector. I have to call my father. He'll want to know. And you need to listen to me, okay? Your father is dead. I'm sorry. He's... What? Dead? He can't be dead. He found something that wanted to stay hidden. Found something? You're not the first to lose control. Your father's assistant. One minute he was fine. The next... He drew a gun on your father. I couldn't stop him. I can't believe this. We have to find out what's behind it all. You're the only one who can help us. Anne? I... I, I want to see his office. We'll arrange for transportation and meet you there. Yes, I'm sorry. Just... This is hard. Of course. You alright? Yes. 
No. <laughs> I don't know. <clears throat> My father and I didn't leave things in a great state. An argument? Yes. It was trivial. A disagreement on how to file some of the specimens. I was mad about something else. I don't remember what. And I took it out on him. It's so stupid. I understand. But we really need your help. I know. I know. I'm just uh, a little lost. Seeing all this again. He was so obsessed. Crazy sometimes. I didn't get a chance to know him. Oh, sometimes I felt the same way. He was a great man. A pioneer. But he could be distant. I felt like an inconvenience growing up. You sound angry. I was angry. Still am, I guess. But sometimes, he was so full of stories, he nearly burst. I loved that about him. It's why I signed up for this work. <laughs> I can't believe he's gone. We'll figure this out. We have to. I need to know what's on the other end of that artifact. What he died for. Then help us hunt down whatever's responsible. You're our last chance. Okay. If anyone can sort through this mess, it's me. Anne. You sure you're up for this? Yes. When Leviathan took control of me, I remember being somewhere cold and dark. But my father taught me to never be afraid of the dark. I'm still amazed your father got his hands on a piece of a reaper. He was so excited. Your claims validated years of work. Did you take appropriate steps to prevent indoctrination? Of course. It was completely shielded, when we all had regular psyche valves. But now, thanks to the artifact, I'm indoctrinated anyway, aren't I? Might as well be a Rachni drone waiting for orders from the Queen. Have you studied the Rachni? I wrote my dissertation on them. My father thought it was a waste of time, but now... It might actually help us understand Leviathan. In what way? We think of the Rachni as telepathic, but there's really no such thing. At short range, the Queen uses pheromones to give orders. At long range, she uses an organic kind of quantum entanglement communicator. Whatever Leviathan does must be similar. Entangling particles to stimulate neural activity. It uses the artifact to establish a connection, and then it controls the mind of anyone near it. We didn't detect any energy emissions from the artifact. But the Reapers were able to use the artifact to trace Leviathan somehow. My theory is that most of the time, the artifact simply acts as a receiver. Hey, Commander. Only be able to trace Need a hand? Through it when it actively takes control of someone. As it did on the asteroid. Right. Unless it needs something, Leviathan doesn't bother communicating. I guess it and my father had something in common. You said Leviathan's control was similar to a quantum entanglement communicator, which is untraceable. Yes. But this isn't a natural QEC. Leviathan has to send a pulse through the artifact to alter your mind and create the quasi-QEC effect. And that can be traced. Right. Just like at the dig site. The Reapers were tracing the signal by activating the artifact. My father wanted to be at that dig site. He was getting too old for long digs. But he hated being stuck in the lab. He nearly missed my graduation because he was on a dig. Showed up still wearing his field gear. God, he'd have hated dying here. What brings you down here, James? Heard you're closing in on the Reaper Killer. Anything that can scare those bastards has to be worth a look. 
It's what I'm hoping. And I know this is hard. But if there's anything more you can tell us... I don't think there's anything more I can tell you. But maybe I can show you. What are you saying? The artifact only sends out a signal when Leviathan's controlling someone. So let it control me. You could trace the signal. I don't like it. But we're out of options. You know better than I do what Leviathan's capable of when threatened. I know it's a long shot, but I have to do this. You're looking for something to fight the Reapers, Commander. I'm looking for the monster that murdered my father. We still don't know what we're looking for. Then let's find out. Commander, this thing we're doing with Anne sounds dangerous as hell. <sighs> Noted. Edie? Energy signature locked in. Waiting for activation. This is pretty gutsy. I don't know about guts. <sighs> Crazy, maybe. I'm gonna be right here. Okay. I'm ready. James, drop the containment shield. Shield is dropped. Artifact online. Anything? Nothing yet. Wait. There's something. I feel a chill. Edie? No trace yet. Hell! Signal is tracking. Maintain connection. Turn back. The darkness can't be breached. No. Maintain connection. Listen to me. I found you, and the Reapers are right behind me. You have brought them. You are a threat. So are you. I've seen what you can do. The war needs you. There is no war. There is only the harvest. Edie, do we have enough? Partial lock. Maintain connection to narrow the search. You heard her. We got enough. I'm hitting the shield. Belay that, Lieutenant. Signal is fading. Maintain connection. We can fight them. We can win this. The cycle cannot be broken. You're wrong. Focusing the point of origin. Maintain connection to narrow the search. I'm stopping this! Back off! Where are you? Where are you? Beyond reach. Trace complete. James! Got him! Okay. Yeah, we're good. Shit. Edie, update. You want a sit rep? Are you kidding me? Look at her. I got it, Lieutenant. Edie, we have a location. <sighs> Hang in there. Leviathan coordinates sent to the Normandy, Shepard. I hope it was worth it. It will be. I'm taking her to Med Lab. See you back on the Normandy. Coordinates match our trace of Leviathan.
Cortez, what's the status on the probe we launched? Tracking it now, Commander. I've confirmed that Leviathan's signal originates from this planet. Heard how, uh, Anne helped us locate it. It's pretty spooky stuff. Never seen anything like it. Can't imagine what's waiting for us down there. Dr. Bryson classified Leviathan as a Reaper killer. It appears it doesn't wish to be found. It doesn't have a choice. We're here. Sure, but now what? Let's suppose it is a Reaper. Is that the kind of help we want? We're not gonna win this war by turning away help. Even if it does have blood on its hands. Commander, new readings from the probe. It's narrowed down Leviathan's location. You're not gonna like it. It's here. There's nothing but ocean. I show a concentration of structures floating on the surface, but the probe's giving us a signal below that. Way below. Underwater? Looks that way. The shuttle should still be able to reach it. Kodiak is spec to nearly a thousand atmospheres, but I've never actually tested that. Guess we're gonna find out. Dad! Some kind of pulse hit us! Systems are shutting down! Brace for impact! Banged up, but I'm good. Have the shuttle, Cortez. Checking now. I'll see if I can get power restored. Copy that. We'll look around. It would seem others have been stranded here as well. We aren't the first to encounter that pulse. Could be Leviathan's last line of defense.
Okay, we're clear. Nice work, Commander. But there's a development. We need to talk. Joker can swing by. Same thing would happen to her. The landing won't be as pretty. I'd say Leviathan has some sort of defense system in place. Now we aren't getting out of here until we find it. So how do we do that? Well, you might be able to use a mech. Looks like it's rigged for diving. I'm game. Chase Leviathan this far. Let's finish this. It's a long ways down. Not gonna sugarcoat it. I hear you, but time's wasting. Shepard, perhaps you are unaware of the degree of risk. Are you seriously proposing? First, we'll need to restore power to get that cargo door open. How? There's your answer. These old Ballard class ships are equipped with exterior power sockets. They use them for emergency repairs. Strip the cells from the shuttle and use those for juice. Hang on, I'll get you started. Got a cell for you, Commander. Find somewhere to plug that in. Commander, we'll hold them off! Leviathan. 
Okay, seals check out. Oxygen pressure is nominal. Systems are a go. It's as ready as I can make it. Let's go. Take care down there, Commander. Closing hatch. Engaging systems. Ready. Testing comm link. I read you. Here goes. <laughs> So far? Copy that. Cortez? Cortez! Read me up there. Looks like I finished the major descent. Can't see much from here. Suit is running up. Emergency systems have come online. Life support operational. <clears throat> Shutting down all non-critical systems to preserve remaining power. Not sure how much juice the emergency thruster will need to get me back to the surface. Worry about that now. Getting some strange readings from the probe. Something is definitely down there. Probe directly below me. Looks like the final drop. Keep moving.
What are you? Something more. <coughs> Your mind belongs to me. Breathe. Anne, what's happening? What's the point of all these harvests? The 
intelligence has one purpose. Preservation of life. That purpose is not being fulfilled. It directed the Reapers to create the mass relays, to speed the time between cycles to greatest efficiency. The galaxy itself became an experiment. Evolution its tool. Will it ever end? Unknown. Until the intelligence finds what it's looking for, the harvest will continue. Do you know anything about the device we're building? It's supposed to be a super weapon. We have watched its construction before. It has never been completed. Those who have tried still fell victim to the harvest. Its outcome is unknown. Okay, you made your point. Will you help stop this cycle? I have searched your mind. You are an anomaly, yet that is not enough. Wait. The cycle will continue. No. You've been watching. You know this cycle is different. We will survive. You will remain here as a servant of our needs. The Reapers will harvest the rest. If you release me, no one has to be harvested. Nothing will change. You're responsible for this. Every race that's ever been destroyed is because of you. And now the Reapers will destroy you too, unless you start fighting. Even if you survive the battle today, the Reapers won't stop, ever. Release me and we have a chance to end this once and for all.
Commander! Snap out! She's freezing! You okay? <coughs> yeah, yeah. I'm fine. Hell of a headache. We're lucky we got you back. What the hell happened out there? We found it. It's real. And a lot more than we ever imagined. So was it worth almost dying for? It was. We exposed it. Pushed it into the light. Whether it likes it or not, it's part of this war now. And it's gonna help fight. It sounds like an impressive accomplishment. Yeah. One for the history books. Commander, I finished reading your report. The Alliance wanted more intelligence on the Reapers. I'd say we got it. Our people will be studying it for years to come. They're already calling it the Leviathan Codex. It rewrites galactic history as we know it. Whatever else it means, it tells me the Reapers had a beginning. And maybe now we'll provide them with an end. That's one way to look at it. I guess it's the only way. So go out there and make it happen. This is a big step in the right direction, Shepard. Good work. Thank you, sir. Hack it out.